Hey, what's going on guys? It's Bozian and welcome back to another one of my videos and today I'm going to be speculating about a piece of leaked coding that we found in the game. There is coding that talks about a mech and a flamethrower and I'm going to show it on screen right now. It says DLC 1 Castle uh, FX Mech Footstep Steam, uh, whatever that means, FX Mech Weapon Flamethrower. And then it says FX Weapon 115 MUZ, and it's in the coding, and I'm not sure if that has anything to do with the mech suit, but it would be cool. Maybe there's a 115 weapon on the left hand, and maybe a flamethrower on the right hand. That would be absolutely insane. So the question here is, is this mech operatable? Will we be able to jump into the suit and uh, use it ourselves? And will the flamethrower on the mech be a usable weapon? I think that would be absolutely incredible. Just to get inside of a mech suit it's something that we've never done before in uh, zombies and in my opinion it just might be one of the coolest things that has ever happened in zombies uh, I don't know it's just running around in a mech uh, it's so overpowered and you just run around absolutely destroying zombies it would just be incredible now we obviously haven't seen a flamethrower since world at war and uh, a lot of people didn't really like the flamethrower so I guess that's kind of why they left it out I mean in black ops 3 there actually is a flamethrower in multiplayer I think I'm not sure but uh, I don't really play multiplayer or campaign. I haven't played both of those game modes, but I only play zombies and uh, I only know what's in zombies. So they obviously have like a flamethrower mechanic in the game, I guess you could say, and they could possibly add it. I mean, they already have it in the game in multiplayer and campaign. Why wouldn't they add it in zombies? So maybe this flamethrower is actually uh, the wonder weapon. And uh, a lot of you might say, what? No, the flamethrower is a wonder weapon. Maybe since it's a wonder weapon, obviously, the flamethrower is going to be absolutely amazing. Maybe it could shoot, uh, like, flame balls, I guess you could say. That sounded kind of kinky, but maybe it could shoot, like, a flame tornado. I don't know. It's just my imagination going to work, but it just sounds absolutely amazing. They could go so many different routes with this. Uh, so many different fire effects could happen with this uh, wonder weapon, and I don't know. Let me know down in the comment section below what you think uh, the flamethrower weapon could could be what kind of uh, feature would you like it to have would you like it to shoot flame uh, tornadoes would you like it to shoot flame balls or something like that I don't know get creative let me know down in the comment section below but anyways the fact that you attach it to a mech is just absolutely crazy I mean I, there's it doesn't say anything about attaching it uh, to the mech but it's obviously attached to the mech already if you don't have to attach it manually so I don't know it's just it seems like it would be something uh, really powerful because you know it's on a mech and uh, the thing that that reminds me of is the Panzer Soldat and uh, we all hated that guy in Origins and uh, I really don't hope that it's coming back maybe it's not a mech suit that we get into that we climb into and maybe it's uh, an enemy I really hope that that's not happening I really hope that we get a more creative looking enemy I don't know I just don't want another Panzer Soldat esque uh, zombie boss and I really hope that it, he's not coming back Do you guys think this would be overpowered because again it's a giant ass mech you would climb into it and it has armor all over it I mean the zombies could they even hit you I mean obviously you have armor that's protecting you I mean you would just be running around destroying zombies and what is the limit to this thing uh, would you only get it like maybe a every few rounds or something like that uh, maybe it has to charge back up every few rounds or maybe it only lasts for a minute or something like that and then you have to go around uh, the map and try to find gas canisters or something like that similar to Mamba the Dead uh, maybe you just have to find stuff around the map and uh, rebuild it I guess you could say because maybe this is a buildable in the map maybe you actually get to build the mech that would be absolutely incredible uh, I don't know this I personally I think this would be uh, one of the greatest features in zombies if they did this I mean to date it would be the greatest thing because just a mech a mech in zombies that's incredible so something that I thought of was maybe that it replaces uh, your shield so we always get some sort of a shield in every single map so maybe this is kind of the shield thing that we get instead of getting a shield maybe we get a whole suit of armor this time and and again, will the zombies even be able uh, to hit you? Maybe this is something special that they're adding into the map 
Maybe this is a mech that we climb into and the zombies aren't even able to hit you. Maybe you could just stand there uh, for like a few minutes or something like that while the timer runs out for it and then you are forced to jump out of it. It would just be incredible. It would be like if you were playing with randoms online or something like that and uh, they weren't keeping any crawlers or something like that. You could just jump into the mech and uh, it would last for maybe a minute or something and then you go use the bathroom because we all know that we have to go uh, take those bathroom breaks sometimes and uh, we can't because we're in the middle of zombies so I don't know it's just incredible uh, it just seems so overpowered and I would love to see this thing in zombies regardless of the overpoweredness I think that Treyarch would be able to balance it uh, with some sort of like a timer or something like that or maybe you get it uh, every few rounds or something like that and uh, with the flamethrower I was thinking what if that thing is actually detachable maybe if you want to keep using the flamethrower you could just pull it off of the mech and keep using it I mean that would be absolutely amazing uh, just some really great ingenuity from Treyarch, I guess you could say, if they actually did that. But uh, this is some really, really wild speculation. What do you guys think about it? I mean, it obviously says mech in the code for Black Ops 3. So, looks like we're going to be getting some sort of a mech in DLC 1, but we have no clue what it is. Uh, cross our fingers for an actual mech suit that we can operate so before I go a lot of you might have been wondering maybe thinking that this could be like uh, the origins robots coming back because you know a mech is just a robot I personally don't think that's gonna happen I doubt that a giant robot would be in the map again uh, but I don't know so that's gonna be it guys hopefully you guys enjoyed this video please leave a rating please subscribe and have a wonderful day see you later